turn it on, turn it on, find it up. That's it. If you need to calibrate it, I believe it's both sticks down. I've already done that for my area. I would probably suggest everybody does that. And anyway, auto takeoff. So you notice I push this for higher modes. Push it again for crazy mode. Now I'm not really sure which way is forward. Apparently that way is. We'll get it back into high, I like high range. Now to flip, you push this one, it beeps. Same for sideways, push it. Let's sport fly it around a little bit. You can see the altitude hold. A little tiny breeze. The only problem I've noticed with if you want to use the trim to go back, it auto lands. So I don't know what the answer to that is. Try it again. Oh, see, it just auto lands, so it must not work as trim at all. Try to do flips on the ro on the roll here. Push forward. Keep going. That's full speed and fast she goes. Oh, <laughs> too many G forces. I think. Should we auto take off out of my hands? See how that works. Bet you haven't seen anybody do that before. If you want to do a normal landing, here's how I do it. And hold full down. This is on high rate. You can see it rips along pretty good. That's hot. Okay, here's low rate. Still rips around pretty good. Now I'll put it in the crazy high rate. Whoa, <laughs> she goes fast. Got 
pretty good range. Well, to me, geez. Oh, there's flashing. I think we finally hit our limit on battery. Yep, slowly goes down. And that's it. Pretty cool, pretty fun. Pretty good flight time. Neat little bird. Thank you, Gearbest, Elliot. Stay tuned, like, subscribe, comment. There'll be more. <laughs>